with me tonight. Let's go to far off places and search for treasures bright. Come dream with me tonight. Let's build a giant airship and sail into the sky. Let's watch the ground so far below. Let's watch the birds as they fly by, fly so high. Come dream with me tonight. I think it should be a little more to the left. No, it's perfect. <laughs> Maybe it should be a little more to the left. Tweed, do you really think you're ever gonna hit Gimmick's place with a cannonball? Don't be a smart Alec LB. This shot will be perfect. <laughs> I'll just... Uh, I'll just... Uh, LB? I'm out of cannonballs. <sighs> this is terrible. LB, run down there and pick up some of my cannonballs. You mean the ones laying around Gimmick's house? Yes. None of which have ever hit Gimmick's house? Yes. Or even landed near Gimmick's house? Yes! 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 Now quit stalling and get to work! Quit stalling, get to work, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Hello, Gimmick. We're back. Yeah, and we got lots of food. It's amazing. <laughs> it's absolutely amazing. It's amazing that we're back? No, 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 no. I'm talking about my invention. In fact, <laughs> it's more of a new discovery, I'd say. Oh, then that explains it. It does? Go on, Gimmick. Tell us. Well... After you left to collect some, uh, uh, food, I was looking at those crystals we found in the ancient hard-to-find city. Yes? I decided to plug one of the crystals into the machine, and <laughs> it started to work. Really? You mean you found a way to use the crystals? Yes! The crystal turned it into a kind of, uh, well, a reducing machine. How many pounds do you plan to lose, Gimmick? <laughs> <laughs> no, Grubby. It's not that kind of reducing machine. When I turn it on, anything inside of this white circle will be reduced to a fraction of its normal size. Anything? Yes, anything. Except for copper, bronze, and certain uh, uh, alloys. You don't have any of that on you, do you? No, I don't think so. Why do you ask? Well, I've tried the machine on many different things, and now I'm ready to try out my invention on living creatures. Hmm, good idea, Gimmick. Hey, what living creatures? Uh, the three of us, to be precise. Uh, I think I'll go pick some more strawberries for lunch. Goodbye. Hold on, Grubby. Don't, don't worry, my boy. According to my calculations, the possibility of a total metabolic disintegration is less than, uh, 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 32.5%. Oh, well, if you put it that way... This should be exciting. Imagine being that small, Grubby. Now, when I push this red button, we will all shrink to a little more than an inch high. Then, when I push the green button, we'll all return to our normal uh, uh, size again. Okay, let's go. Oh, I can't look. Gimmick, I wonder why the remote device didn't shrink like we did. Hmm, that is curious. What's it made of? 
No copper, bronze, or certain alloys. Maybe that's why. Hmm. You could be right, Grubby. Uh-oh. What do you suppose that big shadow is, Gimmick? I don't know. Perhaps a uh, bending of the light rays, which we don't see at our uh, normal size. Or even... What have you been feeding them, Gimmick? Gee, I've never seen the inside of a couch before. Come on, Fuzz won't be able to see us up inside the couch. That is a most excellent idea, Teddy. <laughs> uh, oh, at least I suppose it is. Come on, then. I'm right behind you, Teddy. That cannonball looks too big, Tweed. No, no, they're all the same size. And the name is Tweeg! Hmm, that's strange. It seems to be a little tight. Oof! Oof! To my calculations, we should see some light at the end of the tunnel, eh, eh, well, eh, any time now. That's helpful. Look, down there. Well, imagine that. Come on, everyone, follow me. Ouch! Wow, it looks as big as all of Grundo itself. Indeed. What an adventure. Now aren't you glad you decided to come along, Grubby? I sure am. Just look at the size of those strawberries we picked for lunch. Are you always hungry? Nope, only when I feel like eating something. Come on, let's get a closer look. Take a good look at the world. There's beauty there for us to discover And share it all with one another So take a good look at the world Each blade of grass, each tiny plant Each ladybug, each little ant If you'll look close then you will see They're part of the world like you and me Take a good look at the world There's beauty there for us to discover And share it all with one another So take a good look at the world I never knew how interesting things were up close It's like a whole new world Hey, will you look at the size of this mushroom? And this is salt! I thought only sugar came in cubes. Oh, it's salt, all right. I've done a few studies on it with my, uh, uh, a microscope. Hey, Grubby, look at this. Wow, try chewing on the end of that, would you? There are so many wonderful things to see. We should thank Gimmick for giving us the opportunity. You're right. Thank you for giving us the opportunity to be eaten by a giant fob. 
Oh, my. No oh, goodness. Oh, no. Gimmick, be careful. What do we do now? I don't know, but we've got to do it fast. Gimme! Huh? Whoa! 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 Gimmick? <laughs> Why, <laughs> that was actually rather exciting. I'd say you were threatened on thin ice. <laughs> Grubby, grab a piece of that tape over there and fasten the thread to the tabletop. Okie dokie. There, just like you. <laughs> Now, LB, let's get on with it. We've wasted enough time. down there? Actually, yes. He's fast asleep. Here's your tape, Teddy. <laughs> Grubby, what happened? I don't know. I guess I just got wrapped up in my work. Here, let me help you. This is no time to be humming, Teddy. We gotta go help Gimmick. That's not me humming. It's that house fly. Look out, Gimmick. Ooh. There's a fly on the loose. <laughs> oh, oh, my. Oh. Run, Grubby! Don't rush me. I've only got two feet. Teddy, gimmick, help! Oh, if only I knew where I'd left my uh, uh, encyclopedia. Oh, I thought I put it down right here where this book is. Say, I believe this is my uh, uh, encyclopedia. Oh. <gasps> Don't worry, boys! I found my uh, encyclopedia! I'm very happy for you, Gimmick. Now please do something. Hmm, let me see. If Liberty Gibbet, if Flute, if Fluctuation, ah, here it is. If fly, a name given to the common housefly, otherwise known as Musca Domestica. Hmm. Uh, here's something interesting. What's that, Gimmick? According to this, some ordinary white sugar should do the trick. The sugar bowl's right here, Gimmick. Grubby, let me get on your shoulders. Okay, if you can find them. Ooh. Okay, Grubby, now get out from under me and duck. Let's go, Grubby. Yeah, before that fly finishes dessert. Teddy, you better get more tape to fasten down the spool thing so we can climb down the thread. It's okay, Grubby. We can use the tape you're wearing. Stand still. <laughs> that tickles. Shh. <laughs> that tickles. All right, I found the end. Now just turn around to unwind some tape. Is that enough tape, Teddy? Just a little more, Grubby. Okay. Whoa! What did you say, Grubby? Grubby! Is that enough tape, Teddy? Yes, Grubby. That's plenty. I'll be right down. Welcome to the ground floor, boys. <laughs> Sorry I couldn't be of more assistance. That's okay. The sugar did the trick. I'm sure glad we're not this small all the time. That fly could be a real pest. Indeed. I hadn't thought of all the dangers we might encounter. Having adventures is certainly very interesting. Yeah, but I'm ready to be bored again. 
All we have to do is find a way to push the button on the remote device, and we'll return to our normal, uh, 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 size. <laughs> Don't worry, LB. This time, nothing can possibly go wrong. <laughs> Well, Tweez, at least this time you hit something. <laughs> huh? <laughs> oh, it won't move. Maybe if both of us try, it will. <laughs> Say, I believe I have an idea. Uh, 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 Grubby, can you drag that spoon over this way? Sure, gimmick. Now, Teddy, if my uh, uh, calculations are correct, pressure applied to the southern section of the spoon should cause an opposite reaction in the northern section. Oh, you mean if we jump on the spoon, Grubby will fly up in the air? Precisely! And with his added velocity, he might be able to push down the button on the remote uh, uh, device. I think that's a wonderful idea. I think that's a terrible idea. Uh, but, Grubby, it's the only way. Yeah, I think. Well, okay. Ready, Teddy? Here we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Are you all right, Grubby? I'm okay. I just hope Fuzz isn't thirsty, because he's coming this way. Oh, he looks more hungry. And thirsty. Gimmick, we've got to press the button. Whoa. Hey, we're big again. What happened? Well, Fuzz must have hit the green button and <laughs> enlarged us. You see, the molecular reassembling attachment worked perfectly. Yeah, now that we're all back to uh, uh, normal, uh, oh my, look at the size of him. You didn't tell us your machine could make things big, too. <laughs> uh, uh, well, I'm sure we can return him to his more uh, 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 cuddly size if we can just find the remote device. Fuzz must be sitting on it. Hurry, before he moves off the white circle. Here it is. Help me lift his tail. Oh, gimmick, this fob needs to go on a diet. I've got it. Quickly, get out of the circle and press the uh, 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 red button. Uh oh. an idea. It worked! <laughs> You've had quite an exciting day, haven't you, Fuzz? <laughs> well, I guess we all have. And you found out what one of the crystals from the hard-to-find city does. I can't wait to find out what the others do. Well, can we at least wait till tomorrow? I'm tired. 
Ha, 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 ha.